everybody. Welcome to Storytime. I'm Miss Donna at the Burbank Public Library. So today for Storytime, I thought we would talk about kindness and some animals, pets, and how we're kind to each other. Okay, let's start with our opening song, Hello Everybody. And it goes like this. Well, hello everybody, can you say hello? Say hello. Say hello, well, hello, everybody, can you say hello? Say hello, now we'll clap. Well, hello, everybody, can you clap your hands? Clap your hands, clap your hands. Well, hello, everybody, can you clap your hands? Clap your hands, Let's stomp our feet. Well, hello, everybody, can you stomp your feet? Stomp your feet, stomp your feet. Well, hello, everybody. Can you stomp your feet? Stomp your feet. Good job. All right, so now I thought we would go around to the houses. And do you recognize our little kitty from story time? This is Eddie. Eddie, say hi. Eddie misses you guys. He says hi. You miss them, huh? Yeah, I know. He misses his friends too, but he thought we would go around the neighborhood today and look in which colored house his little friend Kitten is in. Okay, so let's do it together, okay? Little Kitten, little Kitten, can you come out to play? Are you in the, should we try Purple House? Are you in the Purple House today? Well, it's not my little Kitten. That's okay. It's my other friend, Horse. No, that's not Horse. Who is that? That's cow, and cow goes moo. Very good. A little kitten, little kitten, can you come out to play? Are you in the red house today? Let's check. Hmm, that's not little kitten, but who is that? Ruff, ruff, ruff. It's little dog. Hey, little dog, how you doing? Will you help me look for kitten? Little kitten, little kitten, will you come out to play? Are you in the, should we try this, the yellow house today? Hmm, it's not little kitten, but hey, horse, how are you? And what does a horse say? Yay! Hmm, where should we go now? <laughs> little kitten, little kitten, will you come out to play? Are you in the pink house today? It's not my little kitten, it's Bear. Right? It's Bear. He's our sweet bear. What does a bear say? Oh no, he's pretty quiet. He just walks around, eats his berries. He's pretty chill, huh? Hmm. Little kitten, little kitten, will you come out to play? Which house should we go to? Orange or green? Wanna try orange? Are you in the orange house today? <gasps> Look! Oh, yes, 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 yes. It's little kitten. And he's so happy you helped him find little kitten. And now they'll all play together. But who's in the greenhouse? We might as well check. They'll come out to play as well. What do we have? Oh, look, Pig is going to be very happy. Because Pig is there. What does the pig do? He goes, oink, oink, oink. You happy, Eddie? And he says he's happy. Thank you for helping him. All right. Good job. So now I thought we would do a little shaker song. So do you remember? Eddie, you want to stay there? Eddie, you stay on my lap. How's that? Eddie's going to hang with us. I made a little shaker out of a little thermos. Why don't we take a pause and you get your shaker. I know you made one with Miss Ashley a few weeks ago. She had sprinkles. So let's take a pause, go get your shaker, and we'll be back. So do you have your shaker? Okay, let's do our shaker song. It's opposites. High, low, fast, slow. Remember we would do that in story time? Okay, here you go. You test your shaker, we're good. Shake your shakers in the air. Shake them here. Shake it there. Shake your shakers in the air. Shake your shakers. 
Shake your shaker really fast. Shake it slow. And shake it fast. Shake your shaker really fast. Shake your shaker. Now we're gonna go high. Shake your shaker really high. Shake it low. Shake it fast. And shake it slow. Shake your shakers really fast. Shake your shakers. Okay, let's do, let's make our shaker go really loud. What do we do for that? We shake it really fast, right? Here you go. Ready? Really loud. Good job. That's our shaker song. Now, I thought I would read us the Kindness Book. It's illustrated, designed, and written by Todd Parr. This book is in the library, and there are other kindness books on our Hoopla page and our Libby page as well. The Kindness Book by Todd Parr. What is kindness? Kindness is thinking about people's feelings and helping them feel good. Being kind makes you feel good too. Kindness is reading at bedtime to someone you love. We do that, right? Kindness is taking care of your community. The dog, the boy. Kindness is holding the door open for someone. Kindness is listening. Kindness is keeping others safe. See the policewoman stopping the car to let the ducks cross the street? Kindness is free. Kindness is watching out for someone around you. Oh, whoops, by accident he stepped on Mouse's tail. Mouse is okay, but he says he's sorry. Kindness is holding hands. Kindness is being there when someone needs you. It's taking care of yourself as well. See, he's taking a little nap. Kindness help is helping things grow. Look at, elephant is watering the flowers. Kindness is saying something nice. Kindness is not hurting someone's feelings. Kindness is saying sorry. Be kind to yourself, remember? Very important. Kindness is remembering everyone's feelings are important too. Kindness is welcoming someone new to the family. Look, Skunk is joining the pig family. That's nice. Kindness is giving a bug a hug. Kindness is saying hello to someone new. Kindness is saying thank you to those who help others. Look, fireman, is that a doctor, a nurse, and the dog? Kindness is being nice to animals. Look, all the animals. Kindness is letting others be who they are. It's cheering someone up when they're a little sad. It's easy to be kind. There are many, many ways to be kind, but don't forget to be kind to yourself. The end. Nice job. So I just wanted to mention one thing. All the things that you do with your little ones, you do it often and it becomes part of a routine. And if you read, let's say 15 minutes a day, broken down into three five-minute segments a day. It's a time where you two can share together. They're listening to you. Their vocabulary is building. They, you can talk about things, let's say, in a book. What's going to happen next? What are the colors? What char character do they relate to? 
So it's a nice time to spend together and you don't have to be overwhelmed by doing it in a chunk of time. If you could even do it in three, five minute segments, that's perfect. So let's sing our closing song and it's Open Shut Them. Okay, it goes like this. Open, shut them, open, shut them, give a little. Open, shut them, open, shut them, put them in your lap. Creep them, crawl them, creep them, crawl them, right up to your chin. Open wide your little mouth, but do not let them in. Walk them, walk them, slowly walk them, walk them up so high. Reach them, reach them, reach them, reach them, try and touch the sky. Roll them, roll them, roll them, roll them, roll them just like this. Shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them. Now let's blow a kiss. Thank you, everybody, for story time. Thank you for watching. We'll see you soon, okay? Bye.